Welcome to Celebrating Act 2. Celebrating Act 2 is the user manual for the second half of your life. Hi, I'm Donna Lynn from Vigor and Trim, a fitness and health membership site for people over 50 just like you and me. And today you're here at Celebrating Act 2. This is short and sweet where I'm going to show you an exercise tip and a nutrition tip so that you can stay healthy and strong. So today I'm going to show you a chest stretch that you can do anywhere. How about that? That is good because we spend so much time bent over that we're starting to look like this, right? This is not good. Not a good look. And it actually starts uh, degenerating some of the uh, bones in the vertebra. Those muscles pulling over like this start putting pressure on those bones, squeezes your organs, and then pretty soon you're like this in a permanent way. No bueno. So anyways, I'm going to show you this easy stretch and then we'll talk nutrition. All right. So this little guy is really easy to do. Now, you know, when you're standing in line at the grocery store or something like that, or listening to somebody talking or whatever, you know how people kind of put their hands behind their back? Well, I'm going to show you how to do that a little bit and get a little stretch in the chest while you're doing it. That's pretty cool, huh? Yeah, yeah. All right, so I'm going to turn my back. Excuse my back. I'm going to turn it. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to grab up here. See how I'm walking up my to my elbow, all right? And if you can, you're going to grab the other elbow. Now, this arm here isn't quite um, finished re in its recovery, so it doesn't quite go up there yet. Oh, I'm working on it. All right, so anyways, so we're going to grab up here by the elbow, and we're just going to pull, pull back. Yes, and when we do that, that stretches all through the chest. Now, see, I can sit here and I can listen to Joe telling me something, you know, or I can watch a stand in line waiting for the person to get done in front of me, you know, all kinds of things. All right, you want to hold that stretch for about 30 seconds, and that'll feel really good and give your, uh, your chest and your back a lot of room to breathe. All right, now, our nutritional tip today is something I bet you didn't know. Did you think that fat was just a little blob of stuff that just kind of hung out and looked funny? Well, that's not true. We're finding out that fat, particularly the visceral fat, that's what we get in that belly when we have belly fat and the muffin tops and stuff, down deep inside of that is visceral fat. And that visceral fat is actually an active endocrine organ. I know, who would have thunk that? Well, this is the problem with that. That guy puts out some proteins and stuff that are called cytokines, and those guys start making a low-grade inflammation in your body, like enemy agents in, the, in our territory here, and not welcomed, not welcomed at all, because that inflammation leads to diseases. Right, and a lot of body issues, a lot of issues with our health. So we want to keep that inflammation out of there. Now, how do we know that's going to happen? How do we know we have visceral fat? Well, try on your pants. If you're getting a little tight in the waistline, that might just be what's happening. So watch your diet and exercise. You know what to do as a short and sweet fan. And if you don't, just come find me at Vigor and Trim, and we've got a lot of exercises in there for you. All right, well, now... You know why I do this. I do this so that you can live a happy, long, active lifestyle. And I'll look for you next week. This is Celebrating Act 2, short and sweet. Bye. For more on Celebrating Act 2, visit our webpage, follow us on Facebook, subscribe to us on YouTube, and tell your friends. Celebrating Act 2 is the user manual for the second half of your life.